new services Q washers, eBay and YouTube. So what we're looking at here is the TX15150. The reason why it's called the 15150 is the machine itself is doing 150 power at 15 litres. So as we look at the machine here, we've got the hose, gun and lance that comes with the machine. You'll see on here, we've got a very own nozzle. That nozzle can go backwards and forwards for soap. And obviously what we've got there is an onboard soap tank. So we'll take the lid off this. That's where you put your chemical. Now you have got the option if you wanted to, instead of working that way, you can pull this plug out and you'd have a pipe on there. And what you do is you control the amount of chemical on here. You control it in the meantime, while that's bunged off and you're using the tank on board, what you do is use this control here. The water inlet, you've got an half inch feed here. And if we unscrew this off, this is three quarter BSP thread. So it's handy for quick release if you wanted to. Inside there, you'll see a filter. That filter needs to be kept an eye on. So regularly away, keep an eye on that filter. Just put some little pliers in, pull it out, clean it, put it back in. But like I say, this thread is three quarter BSP. We've then got the standard 22 mil coming out on the high pressure on this side, yeah? Pressure gauge on the top, you've got the pressure regulator to turn the pressure up and down if you wanted to. The switch on the machine itself, thermal overload switch, so if it goes over, you've got a block jet or anything else like that, the, the thermal overload switch protects the motor, so it's there as protection. Great little machine at the Interpump, now this is made by Interpump themselves. So you will see these machines in different colours at times, but the machine itself is an Interpump. What we're going to do is take the lid off and show the machine without the lid on. Just unscrew that, lift it all off, and you'll come to the w WW156 Interpump. So like I say, this setup here, on here you've got the oil sighting glass which is visible and easy to check. You can actually check it with a cover on as well, but you'll see the oil is halfway up. And you'll also see there, that's the chemical intake pipe that goes into the back of the system there to control the soap. So that's sucking out the tank itself on that, at that point. This is three phase 415 volt. So it's not the 240 volt, they do the 240 volt, 110 volt as well. Yeah, they also do this as automatic stop start. So it can be automatic stop start, but the only thing is if you've got a, gun, a leak on the gun, the machine will stop and start. That needs to be sorted straight away. You can't afford if you go automatic stop start system for a gun to start leaking. At the back of it here, what you've simply got there is the oil bung. Now you'll notice that there's a hole there, so as you undo that bung, that oil can be changed over. That oil there that can go into that pump, you can buy perfect, absolute interpump oil if you wanted to. But like I say, you'd get away with 15W40 diesel engine oil to go into there if you wanted to. So that is the TX15150. It's also available as a TX12100 and also automatic stop start, which is TXS. Thank you very much, Q services, Q washers, EB and YouTube, like I say, the pressure gauge there, and then you've got the valves on the pump itself. Thank you very much, Q services. Machine 150, three phase machine, 415 volts, 150 power at 15 litres. You'll see the pressure gauge there, so what I'm going to do is turn the machine on first of all. So, the machine is turned on now, water's on for the machine itself.
Moi, je suis allé chez le monsieur qui part. Je pense qu'il m'a eu le temps. Thank you very much. Please say, please watch it. Even in YouTube.